What is going on fam? It's your boy John Michael Howe. Open up your browser, go to music.com, and what do you see? Ba-bam! Ya boy! It's me, on the front page of music.com. So long story made short, one of my buddies, Josh Grant, reached out to me with this uh, post. He DM'd me that music.com had posted and it was 500 artist stories wanted. That was what it was called. So I clicked on it, checked it out, and basically all you needed to do was submit your song story to music.com and they were partnered up with Sony and they were going to pay 500 artists $250 over this quarantine because they know it's been hard for a lot of artists and so I was like okay cool you know if this is legit it's legit if it's not then you know whatever because I've already made a whole song story behind Sky's Not The Limit so I went ahead and just you know dug up that video submitted it to uh, music.com and submitted the you know sky's not the limit the song to it and a couple weeks later I get this payment for 250 bucks and so I was like okay that, that was really cool they actually did it they did the payout and so I was like that's cool you know thanks Josh thanks sound seekers for hitting me up with that shout out to them they're amazing people Josh is an amazing person super helpful and so yeah I got paid that 250 but then what happened was a few weeks later I got paid 250 again from music.com and I was like, okay, like what is this about? And so I was like, maybe they like made a mistake or I didn't really know and I kind of honestly forgot about it until music.com followed me, sent me a direct message and one of the guys from music.com was like, hey man, do you, do you like get an email from us? And I was like, um, I don't know. And so we hopped on the phone and he tells me, dude, you won this competition. And I was like, wait, what? I didn't even realize that this whole submit your song story thing was actually a competition in the first place. I thought it was just like, submit it, we wanna help the artist community out, we're gonna, you know, we're gonna pay you 250 bucks. So I was like, what, I won, like, what do you know? So as it turns out, the thing that music.com was doing was they were getting, you know, Obviously, like I said, all of these artist song stories submitted to have, you know, extra content on their website, but then also to be able to be a support to all the artists during quarantine and during COVID-19 and all that jazz. And so out of all the artist stories that were submitted, and I believe it was 850 plus as of um, a week or two ago. Out of all those stories, they were going to pick 25 to get mixed in Sony's 360 studio. And I didn't even realize all that. I mean, I'd seen something about the Sony 360 studio, but I wasn't fully aware that that's what was happening. So long story short, I'm getting this call from an awesome dude at music.com and he's like, bro, you won the competition. We love your song. And so I was like, what? And he's like, we're going to mix it in Sony 360 studio. So send us your stems. So I sent them my stems and... He was like, oh, also, we want to feature you um, on the front page of music.com. And so I was like, what? And so, yeah, I've been on the front page of music.com for the past week now. And I just remembered, wait a minute, I need to inform you guys about that. Because I know y'all want to be a part of my journey and see what I'm doing. And so, yeah, that was a very nice surprise. Thank you so much, music.com, for uh, sharing me, for giving me a shout out. And thank you, Sony, for... Um, partnering up with them to mix the song Sky's Not The Limit. I can't wait to hear it mixed in 360. It's going to be awesome. And thank you Josh Grant and Sound Seekers for letting me know this competition was happening in the first place. Y'all are the bomb. Peace out fam.